hi guys i just wanted to film this quick flip through i got my cross stitch crazy subscription today um apologies for my nails before i even start i need to sort them yeah <laughs> this is august 2018 issue 244 um this is the magazine and then you've got two free gifts. Apologies for the glare. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, two free metallic threads. Pink, key purple, and the purple. Um, and then you've got this designer top booklet. I'll go into that. Um, in a little while because there's some charts and bits that I can show you <coughs> sorry two seconds let me just grab my coffee sorry I should have thought about this before I started really um okay so I'll give you a flip through um this is out in the shops this week so if anybody is interested uh, we have a Margaret Sherry design. It's called Time to Grow. It says approximate stitch time 40 hours. This lovely garden with the dogs. It's really cute. Um, do, do, do. Do the information for it. It's stitch count of 100 high by 120 wide on 14 count fabric, which is seven and a quarter by eight and a half inches. So, yeah, it uses uh, whole stitches, back stitch, French knots. And it contains fractionals, so a little bit of everything. Um, this doesn't say whether they recommend it, what stitcher, but I guess sort of like an experienced stitcher really for French knot and fractionals. And you just have all the letters. I don't always show these bits, but and then that's continued. There is a cross stitch quickie of a sweet angel fish can't show you that as it's just a char there is a celeb char if I catch it right John Wayne again that is just a chart that is seven and a half by four and three quarters sorry the angel fish is tiny it's two and a half by two and a quarter they do a cross stitch quickie in each of the magazines and next time there's going to be a cute turtle so if I show you that there we go I don't think this video is going to come out okay it looks looking a bit fuzzy so I'm hoping that it's going to come out okay I've got the window and that the side of me but I don't know it might be fine once it's recorded Okay, then we have 50 Coastal Chick Ideas, designed by Susan Bates. And I'll give you close-ups for these. Not close-up on my boob. <laughs> Sorry. Wouldn't be me without the cleavage shot, would it? And yeah, then there's <clears throat> 50 different designs, which I can't, there's more than what's shown on there. Um, out of two of the designs, or alphabets for them. So technically there's only 48. There's crazies, 
this month's must haves. Um, about washi tapes as well, so if anybody's interested in those. Then we've got Wild at Heart by Lucy Heaton. I think I've got you a bit closer, maybe that's why I'm noticing how fuzzy it is. So maybe when it's actually recorded it'll actually be okay because I'm filming on my iPad like I normally do when I do these ones. Uh, this has got just whole stitches and back stitching. Um, it is 150 high by 116 wide and 14 count fabric that's 10 and 3 quarters by 8 and a quarter inches. And it tells you what you need extra skeins of. So I'll just show you. I'm not going to be able to stitch much from that little bit there. But you get the key they give you DMC, Anchor and Madeira it tells you what kind of stitches are in it and then here it's got your stitch count and it says about the extra skeins so that's really handy so you know that you've got plenty because we get these charts and they tell us what we need but they don't tell us how much we need um some can use a little a couple of stitches i've got um something that i'm stitching at the moment i needed five strands of metallic thread um but that's the only place it comes in <clears throat> whereas some of the other colors like the browns and bits i'm using a lot of um but again it doesn't tell me how much i need without actually looking so at the actual chart to sort of see roughly how much i'm gonna need um but yeah, that at least this, if you need more than one skein, you know that you've got it. Um, but yeah, they don't help sort of like how much of a skein you're going to need if you're using it from stash. And uh, I mean, I have the full DMC set and I am running through some of my colours now. I'm running out of a few. But it does help if you know that you're going to need more than one skein of a colour. That is handy. That's something I like about the heaven and earth charts and things. They tell you how much you're going to need all together for each one, for each colour. Okay, then we have... Sorry, I went on a tangent there. <laughs> we have Crazy for Dolphins. I can't show you this because it's just the charts. Um, so, yeah. Does it tell us what we got next time? No, it just tells us what we had previously. Okay, Happy Homes, um, to make these look like little cards, it says celebrate a friend's new home with these bright scenes featuring colourful houses from around the world. These are designed by Poppy Benner. Um, they don't look very big at all, I'll get you sizes in that in a minute. Okay. And they're nice and colourful, um, pretty much full coverage, but again you could maybe just sub some of the background, so like you've got um, a lot of them are on different blues, you could do it on like Blue Ada or something, just save a little bit of time, but to be honest there isn't massive amounts, it is the skies and that really, and because they're small they shouldn't take that long, it says six to seven hours approximately so most of that is actually going to be your actual design excuse me rather than the sky um they are 35 high by 35 wide on 14 count fabric it's two and a half by two and a half inches excuse me So yeah, they're really not that big, but the, the amount of time it's going to take for those, it's quite a lot, but they are really nice. And then we have um, Stitch and Chat. Ok, 
Um, we've got summer style. Pack your bags and get ready for festive festival season with this on-trend trio of sunny day accessories. These are designed by Cheryl McKinnon. So we've got a sunglasses case, a water bottle holder, and a bag. And you get the charts, um, uses, sorry, did I say in the last one? Sorry, the um, house one, sorry, are all cross stitch and some back stitch. So there's whole stitches and back stitch, sorry. Back to these. Um, the feathers, um, whole cross stitches only with some back stitch. The maximum stitch count. Is 71 high by 150 wide, which is 5 by 8 and a quarter inches. And then it tells you how to make a festival bottle bag, so it gives you instructions how to make one. Not for the rest of it, but it gives you instructions for those. Um, I'm not sure if you can maybe find the instructions for the others on the website. It doesn't say, um, but maybe worth a look. And then there is a section on discover cross stitch subscription boxes. We've got um, four different places doing all different bits. Needle minders, fabrics, kits, threads, mixed ones, sort of things. So, yeah, and they all range in different prices from $10.99 upwards. I think the dearest that they've shown here is $22.50, but that's for six months. Um, on a monthly basis, the dearest is £20 a month plus. No, sorry, twenty four ninety nine. Sorry, um, but that's bi monthly. So monthly, the dearest is twenty pound plus postage. So, yeah. If anybody's interested in joining monthly things rather than just like hand dyed fabrics and bits, speaking of, that, I've got a lovely one to show you guys um, when I film an update. Um, yeah, I know lots of us are in those or. Maybe thread clubs and things like that. But if you want something that's got a mix or different bits and pieces, then yeah, there's definitely some different places. I've never heard of a couple of them. Okay, we've got a uh, striker balance. Opposites attract in this tattoo style yin and yang design. Let it be a touch of harmony into your home. Oh, sorry, let it bring a touch of harmony into your home. I can't speak today. Lovely fibro, <clears throat> and this is designed by um, Emma Congdon, and it's only got whole cross stitches. Okay. It says paint a wooden hoop black to match the bold outline of the design. This is 135 high by 135 wide. On 14 count fabric that would be nine and three quarters by nine and three quarter inches and like with this one it's as you need three skeins of DMC okay then we have gifts for guys just little gift tags and these are by Fiona Baker I really cannot speak today. Fiona Baker. Baker. Where did I get? Sorry, Fiona. You've never watched these videos, but sorry. <laughs> um, these are three to four hours each. Um, and I can't show you any more than that. But there is the whole alphabet for like tags. And then here's the numbers. Yeah, there's numbers as well. And there's also um, a new ultimate cross stitch birds. Is a new one that's going to be coming out. Ok, 
Okay, then there's Quick Stitch Kawaii Fast Food. Again, I can't show you these um, because they're just charts. Sorry, the blocks um, are 30 high by 30 wide. Are only whole stitches in them. And they are on 14 count fabric, two and a quarter by two and a quarter inches. <clears throat> then we've got Crazy Angel, Crazy's Angels, not Crazy Angel, well they might be crazy. Um, just questions and answers, people needing help. There's a couple of pages of that. And we've got Ticket to Ride. Kids will simply adore playing with these colourful and easy to stitch transport charts all aboard. Designed by Soze Kitano. Sorry if I've butchered that. Um, whole cross stitches only. Three to five hours each roughly. Sorry, that's a designer's name. I probably butchered it. And they're just these cute um, stitches that you can put onto blocks and on a play mat and that for children. Uh, there's only whole stitch in them. Um, they a max stitch count of 31 high by 35 wide. Um, design area on 14 count fabric, two and a quarter by two and a quarter. Oh, two and a half, sorry. And you've got a uh, challenge Lucy, which I can't show you because they're just charts. Um, but people ask for uh, a design of some sort to be put into them. It's like like this. Can you design me a giraffe playing darts, please, Lucy? And then Lucy will bring them a chart. And there's six different charts there. And you get a I challenge Lucy form that you can fill in. Um, or you can email her as well to get a chart done. Obviously they're only going to be like little quick ones. Then we've got track it down. So if you're looking for an old kit or chart or you're just wondering where you can get something from then they show those. And then we've got a design finder. The chart choices. And these are this month's ones. And then join us online. Quite a few designs and a bit about that. And then download of the month. Um, tutorial of the month and pin of the month. And then we have good fortune. These lucky cats have arrived to wish you the very best on your next big adventure and these are by Devine Jones so as you can see there's different sizes so approximately four to ten hours um, these have whole cross stitches only and back stitch the maximum stitch count so for the bigger blocks is 50 Five high by 55 wide on 14 count fabric it'll be 4 by 4 inches looking at the little ones I look about 20 by 27 sorry 27 by about 27 stitches so it's sort of nearly half the size And then you've just got the cross stitch how to. <coughs> and coming in next month on sale from the 5th, 5th of July. We've got a free um, postcard kit. Cameo Queen. Little Red Riding Hood. Pony in the Sky. Autumn Cuddles. Freshly made. I'm trying to see what you're saying. Um, back to school bits. 
uh, sunflower stitches, cushion. There. And then you just got to take a break to crossword and um, Sudoku. Yeah, that's this issue, and that's uh, August two thousand and eighteen issue two four four. And I believe that will be in the shops Thursday. It might be there before, but I think it's Thursday it comes out now. Okay, so it's already 20 minutes long, so I'll just do a quick look in the designer chart book. And I've got some parcels I need to do up. Okay, it gives you the index of what's in there. It is only like card, like card, and I've just managed to rip mine slowly. Okay, we've got Modern Floral Designs by Cheryl McKinnon. It gives you the designs. And then it shows you how to make a tissue box cover. Then you've got your Vintage Kitchen by Doreen Jones. And it tells you how to make a kitchen pot holder. Then we have Wild About Colour by Heather Nugent. And then it shows you how to make a pocket hanging. Different. And you've got Relax and Revive and designed by Emma Congdon. As we all know, a Stitch Rovio also. And it shows you how to make a travel vanity kit. So yeah, although that doesn't, you're not quite sure what that is on the front, even though it's got the same. I hadn't really took much notice of what it was. <laughs> there we go. Travel vanity kit. It shows you how to make it and put it together. So yeah, these is a free gift. And then metallic threads, which you can use for these designs. So um, I hope to do an update on my stitching maybe next week, week after. We'll see how much I've got to show you now that I've sort of finished Stitch Mania. Um, I've got a couple of pieces that I need to gift out. Um, so I'm going to be stitching exclusively on those for the time being pretty much um, one is late um, it's a birthday gift and the other is a birthday gift which is due this month um, so they're not going to be massive amounts to show although I have been doing other bits and pieces too um, I've got a bookmark that I stitched and one of but anyway I'm rambling um, so yeah I'll come with an update next week week after maybe once i've got some bits to show um and i should have the new um world across stitching magazine to show you all next week as well so until then i'll catch you all later bye guys thanks for watching